Well, good afternoon, everybody. <clears throat> it's what, 551? So, want to get on and go ahead and get on these tourney hits. Do got a chest to open up first. Just completed this just now, so figured I'll restart it now just to see what the chest comes out to be. Alright, not too shabby. At least I got an emblem from it. But, um, yeah, oh, boss man Yuki sent a little picture online with him sipping on a beer, so I told him that I would cheers him. So let me get a fresh brew, huh? There you go. Cheers, brother. All right. We got a Bruja in hand. Smoke's right beside us. Um, we do got this cool offer again. We need to pick what item you want. All this stuff to the with the gems and the flask stays the same no matter what you get. So it's basically just picking your ascension item. So if y'all want to make any guesses on which one I would take, make a guess. Three, two, one. All right. If you can guess the tabard, you're probably right. That means you might have been following my stuff a little bit. Because, not this. I'm good to go on every one of them but the tabard. So any other colored hero but purple, I can ascend on up already. And I got the tombs to do five so I could do one of each once I get my tabard full again so I'll definitely be getting that tabard one and yeah hopefully path of Valor's going good for y'all um all these top three are pretty very simple if you just hop on the game daily those are usually easy to get I mean the knocking the ducks out the sky is something you got to see that they're looking for and actually do it if you don't do it on a normal regular but everything else just playing levels and gathering all your food and stuff from your storages you get a lot of these but yesterday was the first one that was pretty hard that or that i could see hard for some people is when you have to not just win three raids but win three raids in a row i bet you that was could be definitely frustrating because once you you can beat off two characters and get them all done and good to go and then get to your third person you're going against and lose and then you got to restart up all three of them. And if you go and beat a few of them and then don't get it, then you're going to have to use a raid flask or whatever. So I can see that one definitely being difficult for, for some. It's not as easy as all these other ones are, but hopefully y'all are able to get it and get that by the end of the day. All right, that is all my info and rambling, so we'll hop right into the tournament, see how our defense did. Still at a D, and all this was from one day ago, so I didn't get attacked today just yet. And there's a little over eight hours left, so hopefully we'll see, see the end result. So let's hop right on into it. The strong blues and a bunch of emblems. As to be expected. So. Like with my rambling went on yesterday. You got that Boral Tank. Bring Sabina in that regard. So I'll stick with that same method. Alright. So, yeah, we'll just stick with this. I got two blues and the rest are all one color, so I prefer my blue team over my yellow just because Jackal's so squishy. So let's roll with us. Ooh, see what we get. All right, all right, all right, all right. Hmm. Hmm. 
Not really liking it just yet. Let's see if we got other combinations coming up here. Throw that mess in there. Those cascaded that. All right, that brings up my blue. So I'm thinking about going ahead and matching up that purple and red, but that'll fire him off. But then that'll set me up for a blue um, bomb attack, and then that blue attack. Or blue bomb attacks going straight to that repost. So, I think I might go ahead and fire in this blue to get us one step closer to being able to get rid of all that jazz. Oh, lordy. Gonna have to rebuy right off the get. Uh, Got to do this so we can use Sonya. Easy, easy. Alright, so we'll use, use Sonya to get rid of that. Oh, uh, whatever this is called. Uh, the counterattack. And then also to get rid of her guards heal over time. But she doesn't dispel first, so we want to go ahead and hit someone that doesn't have it. And then boom, all their shit cancels out. So we'll go ahead and work on this side. Lovely. Uh, we'll kill off Boral. We're Triton and then send these blues up to Falcon. And then that whole right side is Dundee Bobby Neal. Perfect. And we got a little extra heal just to... Just for shits and giggles, you know. Alright, let's see if this ghost will go ahead and give us what we need. Partially. Partially. How the hell do you got that plus 48? Oh, the family bonus. Oh, because oh, cause Jackal. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, that's nifty. I didn't even think about that shit. Hmm. Maybe I didn't think about it because I was planning on doing all five blues, huh? <laughs> if I was doing a rainbow team, that might have came to me. But all right, plus five defense, plus four healing. So you got that plus 48 defense. So you over a 1,000 on defense. You 963, girl, so... You got to go first. All right. So I ain't gonna fire off into him until he's ready, ready to go. Should probably be this next go around right here. Ooh, not just yet. Ah, oh, Lord Jesus. Don't hit Triton. Alright. Do a little heal action there. Some defense down. A little bit of that, and then we'll let's dispel that shit real quick. Uh, Alright, send these blues up. The defense down. Shh, definitely kill Sonya, but maybe these two blues with that defense down will kill Falcon. And plus, I'm going to make it where it's a combo, combo two, so. One and then two. Boom. Boom shakalaka. Alright, good start. Alright, two blues ain't nothing we can do because we ain't got no greens. Two purples, however, so I want to switch on over to my yellow team. Yeah, hit it. 
Get y'all out the mess. Oh, they finally put all that shit right. Oh, I know why they didn't. Leveled up one of my troops. My yellow one. My yellow mana troop. That was a... Uh, level 18, I believe. I went ahead and brought up to a 19, so I fed a bunch of my threes. So, of course, I'm broke again when it comes to ham, but... Um, between that 18 to level 19, they got the plus one towards attack. And that's my tank for war, so... It'll hit a little, just a little harder whenever he goes off, so. Every little bit helps. It adds up over time. Start out with a level one mana troop, so by the time it gets to 19, it's up, what, plus three or four or five or something, so. As you keep on growing them and leveling them, the better, the better the stats get to your actual hero that you put it on. So, there's that. I'm thinking I still want to do yeah, Sabina for this counterattack and then of course this healing over time. Um, reduces a mana of all enemies. See, that's, I wish she just did it with like three enemies or something, but she does it all to all of them. Oh, lick you over there, motherfucker. Hope she don't go off. Hope her ass don't go off. Alright, we got some yellows to play with. We have got some yellows to play with. Alright, I see that all that combo, three combo to the right. Well, let me go ahead and do the three combo to the right while we got it. Alright, I'm going to send these yellows down to match the blue, which gives a combo two. Which will move that up to make a combo three with the yellows, which will also make a combo four with the greens. And then after that, we might get some more havoc. So there's your one, two, three, four, more havoc. All right, and then we'll send these yellows on up to Regar, see if that's a one hitter quitter. Damn near. Damn near Bubba. I'll go ahead and snipe kill him. Uh, we will snipe kill him as well. Oh, I was hoping one would do it. And then we'll pop the red diamond, which will also send one of the yellows up to that purp towards the purple guy or purple girl. And then hands will be ready. So we'll do that. Um, yeah. It's going to hit both of them even. All right, we'll do her. The just in case. All right, we'll go ahead and set up for a diamond. I'm hoping Sony doesn't. Oh, fuck it. I'll do. I'll go ahead and heal up. Better safe than sorry. All right. Now, not to worry about her. So we'll do the one, two. We'll do. Her for the third one, and hopefully this yellow here kills her. Hopefully these two yellows kill her, and then there'll be one tile going up to her having the defense from down, but then I should have two, three, four, five, six. I'll have Gretel go off, so. Which will then get that final kill. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. All right, it's number two down. Ah, beer is so good. 
Y'all don't drink beer. I feel sorry for y'all. It is so good. All right. Well, ain't nothing we can do with the blues. The yellows will keep on the tank since there's not a multicolor of anything else. There's only one purple and one yellow, so might as well kill off the tank one, huh? So we'll roll with this same team. Or... No, we won't. Because he does the defensive down to me. And he does the elemental defensive down to me. She clears shit out. She does. He does the healing thing. But once I get rid of her guard, there won't be no healing thing available. So... And my yellow should kill off regard before he goes off. If he goes off and I ain't got no yellows on the table, I'll probably lose the whole damn match. So, I need them to get rid of my shit. So, we'll go with that. Leave him out of costume because I don't need the heal over time because Sonya could cancel that shit and lickety split. So, let's roll with it. All right. That's what I'm talking about. These three should kill him. If not, fuck it. We'll, just for safekeeping, we'll go ahead and make it a combo too, at least. So, for show sure it kills his asshole. Four tiles will always kill him off. But the three, he might have a little bit left over. So, so, so. so. So, let's do that first. Ghost in that one counts as four instead of three, so if I get two more matches of purple, he'll be ready to fire instead of me needing one, one whole damn tile left. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Kind of out of yellows. Not good. Bring up some yellows. Darn it. Oh, Lordy. Damn, ain't nothing. Fuck, it sucks when you have to use so many... Clear so many tiles to get into these folks. Come on now, don't kill them. Ooh, lordy. Oh, lordy. All right, I'm going to do this blue to send those yellows up. See what it does, Sonya. Yes, sir. All because of that critical. All because of that critical. Lord Jesus. All right, I'm going to do the small fry first. Mmm, let's see what this big fry does. Let's see what this big fry does one more time. Alright, perfect. So he's dead, so I'm hoping this combo two, actually we'll make it a combo three. We'll send the red down instead of up. So the red down makes a combo, the green up makes a combo, which then will lead to a combo three hitting them with that defensive down, elemental defensive down, so... Red down, there's your combo two, there's your combo three, plus a bonus four, so that definitely did the trick. And perfect timing for her to go off, because his special will not. So let's go to these purple to get a heal. And he still has that jazz going on, so let's go ahead and send four tiles into him. Boom. And then you saw what those four tiles did. Took him down, so let's take his ass one more time down with four tiles plus that yellow hit. Oh, that one didn't do enough. How the hell did it do enough last time? Anyhow, we're going to go see these purples and therefore go see those yellows and it'll be a done deal by Benil. Because he can't kill all three of my jackals with one hit. Yeah. 
cigarette keeps on going out because I'm rambling too much, but <clears throat> trying to show y'all what I see um, before I make my move. Kind of show y'all what I'm thinking in my head and before I do it. So y'all just don't think, oh, damn, that was a lucky cascade. You're just looking through all this stuff because you're getting the boards. There's a little method to my madness. And if y'all haven't noticed, I mean, you know, you get combos after combos, and you're like, oh, that's good because that's more tiles going into it. But each combo goes up 0.1, I believe. So, like, if you hit him one, you hit at your attack at one. If you get combo two, it hits at 1.1 strength. If you get a combo three, it hits at 1.3 strength. And so far and so forth on in. So, the combos are good when the more tiles of your color hits them obviously but the higher the combo is when those tiles hit the harder they hit as well so next time on this battle here check out the combos and you'll see in like the small print it says like 1.1 and the next combo will be 1.2 and so on and so forth so you kind of want to factor that in too instead of just going for the match just to get your tiles Sure, it's feeding more tiles into them, but you might have a better result and kill them off where it doesn't matter. All right, two blues. We don't got green, so they don't matter. And then two purples and a red, so obviously we're going to stick with the same team here. Um, all right, regard is at the end plus Boral. So if either one of them goes off they both do attack buffs to their teammates so this is where I want to bring Sabina back into the mix alright sounds good <clears throat> alright this is not so bueno because none of our yellows are ripped together. So let me get my matches while I got them. Do the blue to the purple and hopefully clearing out those six tiles. We'll bring some more yellows up where I already got the yellows kind of around them so I'm gonna brown a little bit of yellows up it's all good in the hood all right now we're gonna hopefully I don't fuck this up and click it all right we're gonna move the green to the right so the three reds match up send the yellows up so that's a guaranteed yellow match in the middle but if where that green's at, another yellow comes, then it makes a red diamond. Or a yellow diamond, I'm sorry. And if that's not a yellow, it still has a possibility of being a green, which will make a green match, which will send some more yellows up, hopefully. So that's what we're shooting for, is a yellow diamond. And nope, no yellows came up, but we ended up getting three more, so that worked out kind of. All right. So, let's get rid of these diamonds here and go see these purples. Still need a purple. Um, hmm. I don't want to go ahead and take this match with the purple just to heal up because they're getting close. Let's go ahead and do that first. I'm afraid if I wait. That his hit all might kill her, kill Gretel off, especially with that plus 71. Yeah, let me go ahead and 
cancel that little bit off and go ahead and feed him. do this so it hits both of them and it should get Gretel off too because that one got ghosted and it showed in so we'll do that first that second all right we'll do that and that Send those four up into them. Damn, I need a fucking hill. I don't know if I'm going to get in time. I don't think so. Shit. Let's go see these yellows up. Um... He hits all, so I definitely don't want him going off. He hits what? 280 to the target, okay. And then we just got his counterattack to worry about. So we'll do that. Followed by that. Followed by that. And these purples should do it to him. Oh, thank you. Got my heel. Cleared his counter off. Then we'll pop the red that leads to popping the green just to get rid of a boatload of shit here. Alright, perfect. Yeah, I don't see if y'all saw that one or not. That one got up to a uh, 1.7 for the bonus. Revive, huh? You sneaky son of a gun, you. Alright. Alright, last battle. Did not have to rebuy. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. All right, three blues, and then we got the purple and the red. Purple and the red. And they both do the share damage, and then that over time. So we'll bring our blue team in and leave Sabina in, so Sabina could cancel their shit, and then I got the double chance with Sonya canceling their shit. So let's bring the yellow right back on in all right and then all right let's see how we do here all right hmm Do the purple and blue combo. Oh lordy, he gave me a diamond. They're being so nice. Alright. Guess that big old defense, so let me try the Triton hit first, because that's gonna be massive. Alright. 376 ain't really massive, but going against that defense. It's like you lowered. I'm right, we'll gonna go ahead and hit this Sonya. So we could pop that blue, which will set off Carol and Grim. And also one blue tile we hit her, and then the followed up by the purple, which will help out towards my Sabina Hill coming along. Also, combo, combo two attack 1.1. Alright, now. 
now, now, now. Hmm. Let's do... No, we don't need the hill, but we'll go ahead and do that so we get that extra attack. What does she do? She dispels from all allies. All right, so I need her to... None of the shit's going to be on that, so it's up to defense now, but... I don't need her dispelling all my buffs either. Because you see how much harder I'm hitting that plus 738. Because I got these three buffs going with the defense attack and that little health daily whopper that they're doing. Alright, we'll ghost these four to make it pretend like it's eight tiles. Um, I'll go ahead and hit you with the hard triton. And you got the defense down, so we'll hit you with the Sony action. And see if these purple scale you off. Alright, perfect. Alright, now it's basically a done deal. Because whenever Regar's ready to go off with his healing bullshit, I can go ahead and just... <clears throat> Go ahead and cancel that with um, Sabina. Sorry about your luck, bro. Wish you better fortunes next time. And we'll go ahead and give that attack boost for the Carol's regular attack boost with the plus 30, but then we got two buffs also, which makes that attack even harder. And then these two blues should do it with that defense down. Ooh, I spoke too soon, but even if we didn't have that, we had that dragon bomb to kill him, so. Good day five. Went five for five on day five. Ooh, barely puts me in top 1%. I was in top 5% before that attack, so. With this shitty defense, it might still move me back to top 5%, but as of right now, Oh, I'm good. 8,192 is good to have this late in the tournament. I think top, I don't know, I've been top 12 or 13, well not top 12, I've been 12 or 13,000 ranked. And I think I've gotten top 1%, I believe, don't quote me on that, but at 8,001, I think I should be good for staying in top 1. So, defense didn't really hold it down. They held it down in the beginning, but then it all... Went to hell. Finished with a D rating, but yeah. This fur this kind of one of the best tournaments I've had in a in a long while. I don't know if it's my best one ever, but it's it's up there. Not having a rebuy and having still one extra attack, so out of twenty five attacks I only lost three times, so that's pretty good. Pretty good stat in my opinion, and that's with no emblems on any hero. Not even on my yellow team. I don't got not a single one emblem on my yellow, so. <sighs> yeah, I saw it on face teams that I had 20s across the board, 20s and 18s across the board, as far as emblem wise, where they have a total of 90 to 100 emblems. And I do not have a single emblem, and I won 22 out of 25. So. Just goes to show if you're. Resetting your emblems every tournament just so you have emblem guys on your thing. It doesn't make a difference. You can have no emblems and and still get a good defense or no emblems and still beat badass defenses. So, I don't know. I think it's a waste of money for people that put emblems on these things. And that's still, like I said, showed you. Still leaves me at top 1% with no emblems. And not even leveling up the fucking troops. I had one at level six, and then two of my blues and two of my yellows at level four. The rest were regular generic one. So they weren't even like 20 or anything like that. So I don't know. A lot of people put their money and 
emblems and resetting and all that jazz into this shit, but like like I showed you firsthand, if you're watching my video, that shit don't matter for anything. So if you're doing that, please stop because you're wasting your time. So, all right. That's all the ramble I got. That's all the advice I got. But hopefully y'all did good in y'all's tournaments as well. And until next time, tomorrow is a day off, basically. We don't got no events going on. I ain't got nothing to spend gems on. Um, I do my war hits Sunday morning. So I don't got no war video for you tomorrow. So I don't know. Might just do some regular raid videos or maybe drunken raiding with bud i don't know i haven't decided yet but i'm sure i'll make another video here either tonight or tomorrow so hopefully your raid hits did good and hopefully y'all in the top one percent um before i go this is seven hours and 30 minutes left leaderboard i'm at 8192 in top one percent so you can kind of gauge that on where you're at in your rankings so all right like subscribe and comment as always sorry for another long video but i'm gonna make sure i rambled on on what i was doing and so y'all saw, saw how i got those wins all right appreciate y'all watching though thanks again